it's never easy replacing players in key skill positions. But here at Struthers, head coach John Bank is confident in this team, especially with four-year starter Anthony Carter returning to the team. In the hallways during school, in our locker room, in the weight room, he's just a natural leader. Uh, he makes my life easy. Sometimes returning experience can far outweigh statistics on paper. You just can't replicate some of the things you had in kids from last year, but uh, having Anthony Carter back a four-year starter, whenever you have a four-year starter back, uh, that really helps the coaching staff because he can be he's an extra coach on the field for you. Thankfully for Bayek, Carter checks both of those boxes, rushing for 800-plus yards and nine scores while racking up 100 tackles and three interceptions, too. It's a different mindset. You know, it gets hot out here. People want to quit, but that's not us. You know, we just keep the mindset to come out here every day and work harder and just put forth our best effort. But the excitement for Bayek lies with the linemen and the work being put in behind the scenes to get ready for Friday night in the trenches. And we have kids like Vince Boyle and Michael Muter who haven't left the weight room since day one of the offseason. It's just you should, you should gotta know that if you screw up things most likely aren't gonna go right and you just gotta work your hardest all the time. All that paired with linebackers Devin Brayum and Robert Carcelli wreaking havoc on defense, the Wildcats will be ready for week one. I mean, 10 and 0 is always the goal for, I mean, it's especially the goal in my last year, you know, just to have, make sure everybody's good and healthy. I mean, I just want the best for us, and that's all I'm really looking for. In Struthers with the Wildcats football team, I'm Zach Verdia.